Hi, this is Drew with Daniel's Ag Services with your morning report. Markets finished up lower yesterday across the board. They're higher so far this morning across the board. Did get export sales released this morning. Corn came in with in expectations. Beans actually had reductions for this crop year, but sales for next year exceeded what the trade was expecting. And then wheat missed trade expectations. Uh, day three of the crop tour wrapped up yesterday. Uh, was it Illinois and then Western Iowa we got figures from. And both Illinois and Western Iowa exceeded last year's corn yield estimates and exceeded bean pod count estimates from last year as well. So pretty good looking crop over in that neck of the woods. We are also getting some really good rain so far today. Now there is some areas in northeast Iowa that's pretty dry that's not raining there yet. It's got some on the edge of their seat as far as what prices could do, but uh, the majority of the Midwest uh, is doing great. The drought monitor came out this morning. There's really not many dry areas throughout the whole Midwest and uh, getting some good finishing rains here today uh, as we move forward. So. We also got some data out of Stats Canada this morning at 7.30 Central. They estimated their oil seed production and their wheat production. Wheat production is expected to come in at 27.7 million metric tons, and that's actually down from last year. However, beans are expected to come in at a record at 5.9 million metric tons. So got that out of Stats Canada this morning. And other than that, not much else to comment on. Again, getting some rains. Went over export sales. Day three of the Pro Farmer uh crop tour and then also what Stats Canada said. So the Pro Farmer crop tour will actually wrap up today. I believe they meet up in Rochester, Minnesota, I want to say, uh, and we'll get the final estimates there either uh, this afternoon or tomorrow morning. We'll definitely let you know what those say tomorrow. So if you've got any questions, let me know. Otherwise, we'll see you tomorrow. This material is conveyed as a solicitation for entering into a derivatives transaction. This material has been prepared by Daniels Ag Services broker who provides research market commentary and trade recommendations as part of his or her solicitation for accounts and solicitation for trades. Daniels Ag Services, its principals, brokers, and employees may trade in derivatives for their own accounts or for the accounts of others. Due to various factors such as risk tolerance, margin requirements, trading objectives, short-term versus long-term strategies, technical versus fundamental market analysis, and other factors, such trading may result in the initiation or liquidation of positions that are different from or contrary to the opinions and recommendations contained therein. Past performance is not necessarily indicative of future performance. The risk of loss in trading futures contracts or commodity options can be substantial, and therefore investors should understand the risks involved in taking leveraged positions and must assume responsibility for the risks associated with such investments and for their results. You should carefully consider whether such trading is suitable for you in light of your circumstances and financial resources. You should read the Risk Disclosure Access at www.danielsagservices.com. Daniels Ag Services is not affiliated with, nor does it endorse any trading system, newsletter, or similar service. Daniels Ag Services does not guarantee or verify any performance claims made by such systems or services.